while you're traveling, how does the expenses work? Are you just taking Daddy America's credit card and you're just kind of doing whatever as you travel to Beijing? And when are you? Oh, uh, yeah. So I leave. We have to we go to team processing in L.A. on the 25th. So in like five Holy days. Shit, bro. Yeah. That's so I know, soon. I, 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 yeah. Oh my I, was God. Also, I was up a little late last night, too. I was like, oh, man, I got so much to pack. Like, oh, boy. Like, oh, this is God. good. Yeah, How do you I was get like, your right. equipment there? Like to Beijing or just like to, to the Beijing. airport? Either. Uh, so we like we fly to LA, like it's just a regular flight. I don't know. I mean, you got to bring like pack the butt, like bike box. Because I mean, we still like, you almost have to just like connect. We ride our bike as much as we skate pretty much. Do you just have to bring an elliptical bike? No, no, no. Like a road bike you that you like. A- you, Oh, you put the spinny thing up. Yeah. So you yeah, bring you you're bringing a road bike to China. <laughs> That's crazy. Yeah. That's then be you a put debacle. it on. Yeah. I mean, it kind of. I mean, you just get used to packing it at a certain point. It's just, yeah. I mean, just taking it apart can be a kind of a pain, but it is what it is. You just, it's what you do. Because I mean, you we like when you warm up on your bike, unless you run, but most people warm up on the bike. And yeah, I mean, just, just something that it's a, it's something you you can be consistent with, at least for us, like, Mm. you know, just, you know, I mean, an athlete too, you know, like just changing something up, if you maybe a different pair of shoes or something, like all of a sudden your knee hurts and you're just like, Oh, that's not good. That's not it. Especially. Yeah. It's especially me. If you're under stress, it's just like your body does weird things under stress so keeping things as consistent as you can is a big thing and your mind does weird things too you yeah start saying, you're just like, oh my knee hurt a little bit i need to change everything this is a yeah, shit show yeah yeah that's exactly so you're going so, to la on the 25th and then what's what's the process after that uh i think we do team processing the 26th then we have to have everything packed up that night for the flight 27th in the morning to go to beijing Wow. And then you move into the athlete village. Yeah. Wow. And that's going to be pretty, pretty crazy. to Just see all your, all the people yeah. you've been competing against or dreaming of competing against for so many years, just, just going yeah. to chill and walking around. What is, yeah. uh, what's one sport other than speed skating you're not going to miss in these games? Oh, uh, I mean, like short track is it's, they haven't, it's been a little weird for like, if we'll be able to go watch other events. Mm. I think my two events are in the first, or at least like I have five K's the second day of the games. And then the team pursuits day nine and 11. So there's still going to be a few days afterwards, but I'm not sure what else is going on like around like Beijing. Cause there's kind of like three campuses mm. for everything. So like the other one other campus i believe for like bobsled luge skeleton is like i don't know 40 miles away and then skiing is like 120 miles away wow yeah or like 100 so it's not like all like super just like bunched together it can be a little bit spread out but i mean i'm here like we'll have a live feed back to like the olympic village like in our like dorm rooms and such so that's really cool. What have you just, heard about what the Olympic Village is going to be like? Are you didn't in uh, Tokyo? Didn't they have like the cardboard beds? Are you guys rocking them? Yeah, stuff? I don't think I don't think they're cardboard beds, but I mean, we'll see. I mean, you never know until you get there. It's kind of like the scary <laughs> thing about travel. Back so uh, during World Cups this past fall, <laughs> we uh, when we were in Norway, we so like most you end up having a roommate for the trip. Unless it's I mean, just you know, with COVID, like they tried to have individual rooms if possible, but there just wasn't enough room or a hotel room. So like I, me and my roommate, I mean, we've been teammates for years now, but we walked into our room and it was only one bed, like uh. one like like a like a queen size bed. <laughs> and we were just like, you know, like we <laughs> we don't hate each other at all, but we were just like we like this, I we were just like we don't think we could do this for like a week because we oh, were trying. A week, yeah, we were that just like we. Point. 
yeah we were just like i we don't know about this and everybody was like oh it'll be fine and we were able to separate like the bed it was like two like i don't know smaller frames put together with like a bigger mattress on top so i mean we were able Mm. to i don't know sneak uh a cot mattress into our room so like for like the other person but just our bad situation was just a little little weird but it's just things like that where you're just like yeah uh-huh and like we asked the we ended up going down to like the hotel like desk and they were just like oh yeah that's for two people and we were like well are you sure <laughs> like it i mean that week we were doing like a 10k and with how the qualification was like our own u.s olympic qualifications were like we could have possibly qualified in norway before olympic trials even happened so that's why we were just like i mean we we're just trying to make sure like we slept good and like we mm. just kept everything you know i mean normal that we weren't yeah. just like i don't know i mean somebody moves around in their sleep and it's just like you don't want to hit them to wake them up but it's just like you don't want to ruin their 10k Jeez. yeah yeah exactly like it's just Man. lots of uncertainty, but I've heard everybody gets their own room or at least like in an apartment, everybody gets their own room or bed. So that's, that's good. Uh-huh.